Lomas never had to deal with that stuff because you didn't call out your quarterbacks a lot. <laughs> Did you? No, no, what I would do Did you is ever? Just, no, I didn't coach. Know how I would get them? Just yeah. let the guy hit them. Just let the D-lineman get You're a shot You're not going to do them. your job, Lomas? I Come mean, on. I make it look good. <laughs> I had some actor in me. You're going to make it look good. You Wait, can't blatantly. Oh, I just whiffed on him. You can't uh. blatantly let. Now, nah, that happened to Scott Mitchell. All right, give me the. All right, so Mitchell, when you guys were the Detroit we Lions. We were at Detroit Lions. We were playing Green Bay and Milwaukee. We were getting beat 24 to 3 at that time, and he just stunk up the place, throwing interceptions, just everything. So I looked at Kevin Glover, our all-pro center, and I said, Glove, that is it. I say I'm getting him out the game. So I gave it the the set out, and but I got the gator arms on the guy at the last minute. He got around me. He hit Scott Mitchell. He did something to his finger. I don't know which finger it was. Dislocated it. Yeah, but he came out the game. Oh. Dave Craig came in the game. We ended up losing that game 27 to 24. Now, that man came in and got some work done. That man that got out the game, I don't know what he was in there doing. But as you can tell, I'm not a big fa- fan of uh, Scott Mitchell. He's just not on my Christmas list. I still can't believe you told us that story about getting Scott Mitchell. That's yeah. right. The thing is, yeah. if you were a mean guy, yeah. you get heat, but people would be like, oh, big low. Yeah, yeah, but hey, if your quarterback sucks, you don't want him in there. <laughs>